It's so heavy. He can't even pick it up. The size of this one. Come on, bicep curls. <laughs> <laughs> he can't even do it. I'll be living on day. I'll be living on day. I'll be moving along, singing my song. Running around, ain't nothing wrong. In the last episode, which I hope you didn't miss, we cruised up north to one of our favorite reefs discovered last year, Little Broadhurst. After dropping the anchor and spending the night, we decided to go for a spur fishing session where Jan managed to catch two coral trout. Lunch is secured! So what do we have here? To the beast! That's a big one. Oh! <laughs> That's a big one. And we've got another one here. <laughs> What's happening here? She voted in a calamari. Like, look at, look at that. That just came out of her mouth. As promised, here is our new recipe of the moment, chickpea battered fish. delicious so now we're gonna go and dive again this afternoon and we're gonna go in that area Diving twice today. This morning, Jan caught two, I'm gonna say medium coral trout. Uh, <laughs> and I'm saying medium, let me show you why. So, what'd you get this time? <laughs> you A can't monster. even take it up. <laughs> it's so heavy. You can't even pick it up. <laughs> the size of this one. Come on, bicep curls. <laughs> <laughs> he can't even do it. <laughs> 
Wow, it's gigantic. It's not a fish, it's a beef or something. Woo. That was something. It almost took me down. <laughs> I tried to pull and it was just getting me under the crawls. I was just like, no, I'm gonna win. And he didn't give up, but I won. All right, filleting time. I think that's gonna take a while. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> A few moments later. So this is half of the fish. <laughs> we still have another half coming on the way. That's the side of fillet. <laughs> That's like four fishes put together. It's huge. It's not gonna have feet. And it's like it's big as well. <laughs> That's the biggest plate we've got. <laughs> the plate looks ridiculous next to it. Okay. Well <laughs> Yep. <laughs> That's the biggest plate we've got anyway, so... It's got to be this one. You happy? Yep. Good job. We're gonna have heaps of fish. Ba -la 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 -la. So that's the fish finished. <laughs> Look at this. Beautiful good, job. Good job, Alice. Look how big that is. The head is the same size yes, as you. Yes, same size. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> All right, you can throw it in the water. Good job. Big bomb in the water. Show the fillet. Look at this. That's bigger than her head. <laughs> All right, that's plenty of food. Happy. <laughs> to go into the belly. <laughs> Happy. Good morning! So it's day three on the reef. The weather is finally nice, there's barely any swell. So what should we do? We're gonna go in the water. Technically low tide is at quarter to 1 p.m. but we're still gonna go for a snorkel around 9.30. If we stay in the water two to three hours like we did yesterday, we are bound to have current at some point anyways. But I think we'll just tow the dinghy, go with the current and that should be fine. I can't wait. The theme of this session was to have fun. We decided not to go for more than one fish because we already had enough thanks to the two previous sessions. So today we are mostly exploring and trying to find cracks and tunnels in the reef.
Oh my god, what a die. Didn't I tell you the coral here was breathtaking? I mean, if you imagine a movie about underwater kingdom, this is what you picture, right? The only thing that's missing is mermaids. So we did catch another fish. Afterward, we were supposed to stop spur fishing. So imagine my surprise when Yan shot that fish that I was following. But I get it. I mean, it's a good fish. It's a Chinese footballer, which is another kind of trout. So it would have been a nice change, but wasn't meant to be anyways it's almost time to leave this reef but i think we still have time for one other dive so join us next week if you want to see that it's really one that you don't want to miss because it's in our favorite zone on this reef which is quite far away but now that there is no swell and it's all flat the dinghy ride should be doable even with four people so that's why we're going it's really a spot that you want to see so i hope you enjoyed the video make sure to give us a thumbs up and to subscribe don't forget to hit the notification bell and come next time so you can see this amazing dive and find out where we're heading next see you next time bye